Hey guys, because we're human beings, we go through a bunch of embarrassing moments. And if you're anything like me, you beat yourself up about it for years and years afterwards. I do a lot of embarrassing things. I'm not gonna name them all and I'm not gonna name the worst, but I'm gonna name a few of them just to help you guys out. I have a bunch of embarrassing moments, just like this. I gotta get in my Pepsi. Another thing is that once in class I bent down and I farted so loudly. It was so embarrassing. Another time was, well, I like this girl and um, I went over her house just like a play day. I was in elementary school, a low. I think I was like in second grade or something. And we did something like a handshake to a brother and I got excited about it because I did it good and I ran around the corner and I was like yes because I did it good and her dad saw me and he started laughing and that fat one that I said before that's nothing this still tortures me to now and it was so embarrassing and I just ran away I could I just ran away and ignored it but then it wasn't embarrassing but now when I think about it I'm just like oh my god that's really embarrassing when she probably doesn't even remember that. She probably just barely remembers me. But I think the best thing to do, well, not the best thing, but probably one of the greatest things to do when you're not feeling good about yourself or something is watch other people's failure and stupidity and embarrassing moments. So here are a couple of embarrassing moments that people have done. Well, this one, um, she's not facing the camera the right way, which I would think is a pretty embarrassing if you're in public but when you think of it it's basically like when you turn your iPhone camera on and it's the front forward camera instead of the out one when you want the out one you're just like ah because you just see yourself so it's kind of like that except other people notice it the next one looks like a Facebook status and it's of a girl I think that says boys with eyes hot 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 me too. I love girls when they have noses. I think that's really good. It's a really unique quality. You don't see people with noses around a lot. Same with eyeballs too. So I really get what she's saying. I really, really do. This girl looks like she's, um, she never had gas lessons, I guess. Maybe the other type of gas. Fighting. But she definitely did not have car gas lessons and she's spilling it all over her car. So this one's a Facebook status and it says, was just trapped on the escalator for hours. Power went out. Why didn't you just walk down the escalator? Cause it stopped moving. An escalator is just moving steps. Oh yeah, it is. Did you mean elevator? No, an escalator. The next one kind of looks really stupid because she's holding a thing to the camera when you really could just use zoom but you know what maybe she invented the zoom who knew if that was the person who invented the zoom button and she was just tired tired of taking her binoculars and putting them towards the camera lens you gotta give us a break or maybe she's just stupid i'm gonna go with the second one this one's another facebook status i think the titanic is fake because how do they record it when they are all dying in the water it's a remake of what actually happened, isn't it? So the people in the movie aren't alive? I'm not... N no. They... They... What? They... What? But in all serious, guys, people do stupid things all the time. Everyone does stupid things. And you cannot be yourself about it because you probably will not remember it in years. Unless if you pooped on your family table during Thanksgiving, then I feel sorry for you. But I don't think that's the case. And if someone ever confronts you of doing stupid things, just tell them that we're all human and we all do stupid things. Who really cares if you do stupid things? And plus, sometimes it's funny and it makes people laugh. Hashtag pugs, hashtag see you later.